if you have great uh, physicians and a great staff delivering great quality, quality medicine, then it only stands to reason that you would want to have a facility that just looks beautiful, that's part of that overall healing process. And that's, that's not just what we've tried to do here, but that's what we have done here. The hospital from day one uh, knew that art was going to be part of the healing process and that was evident when they set out with an art committee that actually was developing an art and healing program. We had a good start. Um, the arts design committee as we were moving into this and building this new hospital, they're the ones who took off with this and they developed the vision. This is a part of a, of a policy. Um, that, that they laid out a vision. I'm, I'm not sure if they knew how they were going to get there, if we would get there, but we're bringing that vision to life and that's the Arts and Healing program. Well, the actual mission of Owensboro Health is we want to heal the sick and improve the health of the communities we serve. And so you can think about that in a clinical setting like this with white coats and stethoscopes. Or you can think about it differently, and that's what we tried to do, certainly with this facility in terms of soft lighting, the carpet, the colors of the carpet, the curves in the building. We did all that in recognition of we wanted to have a better patient experience, we wanted to improve the healing process. But then as we got into it, we realized that art is one of those things that when you, when you see art, it does have such a much more soothing and healing and comfortable effect. So uh, it was logical as part of our mission to really think about it intentionally. When you talk about healing the sick, we've got great physicians here, but physicians can only do so much. There's other things that play into that and certainly art uh, is part of that and has become uh, a tactic that's part of our core mission. You know, the literature does reveal that, that art and music, um, both visual art, um, theater, it impacts the health of an individual and not just attending those or not just seeing those but being integrated. And if you look at the grounds of this facility, it is the total package with the artwork, with the walking trails, with the landscaping. You're going to see sculpture, you're going to see additional water, you're going to see soft, neutral and natural colors. You're going to see visual art all through the hospital. Um, on every floor there's, there's a theme, if you will. You'll see photography, you'll see paintings. And we've got a lot more to do. We've got performing arts to bring through here. Uh, we've got things that are more active than just static pictures on a wall that really gets at more of the, of the healing process and the engagement with our patients and our family members. And that's where we're going. That's the next step in what we want to do. A healthy community has uh, healthy people, good arts, a uh, great hospital. You, you know, it takes more than just one little segment in a community. And, and so, Owensboro Health has made a commitment to a healthy community, not just through doctors and, and hospital settings, but through a healthy community that uh, is rich with the arts. No question that art plays a tremendous role in, in the healing process. It is, it is one piece of the overall patient experience. So there's stories after stories that I can tell about, about how we've engaged the arts and we're not done. We've really only just begun.